Hi, my name's Tara, and this is my assistant. I'm Michelle. We are going to be teaching you how to make a wine bottle into a candle holder. So, we gave you your list of supplies at the beginning. So, for right now, you're going to need your rubbing alcohol, your wine bottle, a pair of scissors, a lighter, and your string, and a bucket of water. I already cut my string. We're just going to keep folding it uh, like so. You want it to be really thick. And we're going to take it and wrap it around the wine bottle where you want it to cut at. You can, if you have like tall candles or short candles, it's just kind of whatever size you're trying to make it. So you'll tie it real tight. Michelle's going to hold her finger there for me to make it tight. And there you go. And then cut off the excess string and then just slide it right off and then you'll dip the string in the alcohol make sure it's completely submerged in there and really soak it and then take it and put it right back on the bottle and make it a little lower than where you originally want it to cut because it's going to break above the string. So we're going to do it right there because we have taller candles. Okie dokie. So now, why is it on fire? Ooh. You should get a nice flame going. And then just keep rotating the bottle. Like this. Yeah. All right, so now you're going to submerge it in your water. And like you heard, it just broke right off. Like so. Okay, so we've cut our bottle and now we need to make sure that we um, sand the top of it or you cut it so it's not sharp and you don't cut yourself. So this is a sanding sponge. Um, and you'll just take it and just kind of rub it all the way around the bottle. I'm kind of doing the outside, not just on the top to make sure that the outside edges are rounded and they don't cut you. And then you can do the same thing for the inside. Just kind of take it and do that on the inside. Put it, put it at an angle so you can shape it. Okay, so once you do that, it should be pretty, pretty smooth. It's not cutting me, so we're good. So once you do that, you can really choose any kind of decorations you want to do. I want to do with the twine. That's how I want to decorate my candle holder. So I'll take this twine. You're going to have to just find your starter for it. I have two different colors because I'm going to do like a, a dark and then a light. I'm going to do two, a, a two-tone. So just kind of put it on its side. Um, I also have this hot glue gun. So I'm going to glue the twine to the bottle. And I just 